Let me give you eight reasons that why blockchain is the future technology. When I was doing my MBA and after completing my MBA, I had an option to work in a company and take the job. But I was really lucky that I got a chance to work as a freelancer, as a WordPress developer. It took me three months to get my first client. I did almost every single thing you can imagine. Cold calls, cold email, Instagram messages, Facebook messages, Discord server messages. I did all of the things. And finally, after three months, I got my first client. He, gave, he trusted me. He gave me the project. It was a membership website. And after that, things eventually took well. We got a lot of referrals, a lot of clients. And during my MBA, I was making very good money. During my WordPress development, I also struggled a lot because I had no coding background. I had no knowledge of coding. I know everything that how website works, how we can build that using the plugin. Because if you know about WordPress, it's a CMS platform. Pre-built templates exist. Plugins are there. If you want to build something, you can simply install the plugin, install the templates, and you will have the website ready for the specific industry. So that what exactly I was doing. So I don't know what happened. Like sometimes the clients were asking certain functionality, customization. So in those times, I was struggling a lot because I had no idea that how to do those things. So I used to hire the developer to work on the project. So like one day I literally asked myself that if I really want to see my career as a developer, so this is not the way I can pursue my career. Like this will not help me right now. It's, it's going well, but in near future, it's not going to help me at all. I have to learn about the programming language. And that's how I got interest in the development fields. I started learning about the JavaScript. Initially, I started with the PHP and the Python, but I was not comfortable with that. Then I learned about the JavaScript because JavaScript is a multi language you can use everywhere, back end, front end, everywhere you can use it. In mobile application, you can also use it. So I got interest in JavaScript and I started learning about it. I'm really glad that I took one course by Jonathan. That course is absolutely phenomenal. That course built my foundations. Whatever I am right now because of that course. So I really want to thank him. All the time I say thank whenever I build any project. He was the one who taught me. Like I spent close to 10 lakhs in my MBA. And that course he provided me in close to 500 or 600 in Indian rupees. Taught me more value than the money I have spent in my MBA. <laughs> okay. So that's how I got interest. And that's how I learned about the programming languages. And still I remember the day in 2018, February 2nd, was the day I came to know about this blockchain and its utility, the use case we can have, and the problem it solved in the centralized system. So my brother, he is a huge fan of crypto. He do trading all the time. So he was doing trading and earlier I had a concept that blockchain means cryptocurrency. Cryptocurrency. But later when I started learning about it, when I was step into the field of development deeply, I was totally focusing on the coding. I learned that this is something big. It can solve huge problems. So I read an article. I can't remember that article. In that, they highlight the utilities, that what kind of problem it can solve in the near future. And what are the problems we have right now in the centralized system, in the control system we live? Whatever we do, we are in control of someone or some organizations. So that, was, uh, that, uh, that article was a huge eye-opener for me. And that's how I got interest. That's how I started learning about the blockchain protocol. And I was really lucky that JavaScript and Salty, they both are very common. So it took me like one or two weeks to get the entire concept clear in the Salty smart contract and start building the contract, learning about the Ethereum, learning about the blockchain, learning about the how the transaction happened. So that's how I came into the field of development. And since then, I was totally focusing in the field of blockchains and I decided that this is the field where I want to go in. I don't. I, I did complete my MBA, but I didn't took the job. And that was my entire journey, how I came in the blockchain development, how I learned the programming language, and how I strongly believe. And that's these are the eight points which I strongly believe that it's going to be there in future. And blockchain will utilize this. And that's why I stand by right now. No matter, we got a lot of critics about this blockchain. Big YouTubers talk about this, that, that this technology is fake. No, you should not learn. But I believe that it has huge potential. It solves a lot of problems. It's not only strict to crypto. It has more.